frosty morning I'm heading out because I want to catch the sunrise so, uh, that's why I'm rushing a bit just looked out the window it seemed to me that uh, when the sun rose above the horizon it would light the clouds up nicely everything's frozen <laughs> my uh, paddle leash is stiff with ice as well. Tobin Mori waking up. Fish farm's boat fish farm boats going out. at the top end of Carve Island. Just about to head out into the Sound of Malt. Then he and over there on the left. Out in the Merkin Peninsula and straight ahead. In the top end of the Morven Peninsula. Behind which is Loch Sunat. And whenever I come around here, at this point there's often a seal, just one more solitary seal. And I see him or her. Cormorant. No seal. <laughs> well for a spur of the moment decision. I'm really pleased I came out. But, uh, I didn't need that second cup of coffee, so uh, I won't miss it. I might prefer to be out here. Oh, the seal is here. Yeah. There it is. Go to the camera, I'll pick it up. Snout sticking out above the water. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll see some otters today as well. Two of them. Three. Good morning.
steam or a mist rising off the surface of the sea. Heron just blown off. And there's an otter right in front of me. Quietly, hopefully it will um, emerge. There it is, <laughs> swimming to the shore. With this breakfast, just gone under again. Nice and quiet now that that boat's gone. A very calm sea. Waves are just caressing the shoreline there. So quiet, I can hear the dogs barking from over in Drimmen on Morven over there. Just over a mile or so away. Still an otter fishing or hunting a bit further ahead. I think what happens is that as I paddle forward it will swim ahead of me. Sun's just about to make an appearance.
Good morning. Light is compelling. Just want to paddle down like a pathway, paddle into the light. It's beautiful out here. Really, really beautiful. I'm now down at the um, bottom end of Carve Island, quite close to the Dorlin. It sort of narrows between uh, the Isle of Mull and, and Carve Island. There's still one seal hanging around. So as I paddle back, I'm going to share with you something which I've been thinking about doing for ages and ages and ages, and that's becoming a YouTube vlogger. At the tender age of 57, I've decided that I'd like to have a go at telling stories on YouTube, sharing experiences of my life here in Scotland, and just taking you with me as I enjoy the wild spaces, enjoy exploring, enjoy kayaking, enjoy mountaineering, enjoy walking, um, enjoying the culture, enjoying the history, um, and just the joy of living up here in Scotland. I think I'm very privileged to lead the life that I do. and. Um, Yes, I'd like to to share that with you, and I hope that you'll join me on my journey as I grow into becoming a filmmaker. Um, I like the idea of being creative, uh, looking forward to thinking of stories to tell and research. I'm looking forward to just taking you with me on my, my adventures, really, and sharing them with you. Um, I'm also looking forward to talking to you about other aspects of my life that are very important to me um, in the hope that uh, I offer insights and uh, wisdom for folks um, particularly around my mental health and uh, my recovery from depression or living with depression how I keep myself well and how being out in this environment is uh, so beneficial for me and my mental health, my mental well-being. Um, 
but there's so many aspects of, of this this life that I lead that I think well I know that I want to share I want to I want to explore really so by opening up and exploring through YouTube and telling my stories <laughs> to an audience um, I can make meaning for myself um, rather than just sitting at home and thinking it through on my own in a way I feel like I'm having a conversation and um, you know maybe a community will build up and I'll get to hear back from you and you'll share your own ideas or thoughts about what I've been sharing and that that uh, that would be great for me um, so that's my plan <laughs> quite simply um, idea I have an idea of how many films up to about three a month maybe and uh, and see how it goes I'm pretty confident that uh, I'll be able to find enough subjects to talk about because there is so much that I'm interested in and I do know that people are, you know the feedback I've received particularly from many of my Twitter followers um, is that people are interested in, in what I do and they're interested in, in my my life so uh, I suppose it's akin to writing a book isn't it um, but instead I'm just doing it through the medium of, uh, of video and uh, people can either take it or leave it really and that's that's the other thing that's, um, that's the good thing about um, I suppose social media in that sense is that you can either take it or leave it anyway so please subscribe if you want to follow my journey and uh, it also helps I think with the algorithm if you like the videos and maybe I can reach more and more people as time goes by so uh, thanks very much and uh, I'll see you on another film.